Hi there, I'm Alex from PHP Academy and this is another video tutorial produced for the new Boston. This time we're going to be talking about the print um, language construct in PHP. Now you can see that I'm using the previous echo example here um, from the previous video talking about echoing out data to the user's browser or string data to the user's browser. Now print does not differ whatsoever. Uh, just for the purposes of this tutorial, I'm going to um, just change this text to hello with an exclamation mark. Um, so I'm also going to change this to print. You can see my text editor has highlighted this blue again. So we can see that this is, um, this is a language construct uh, and it's still valid. However, when we refresh, we get exactly the same result as we do with echo. Now, you may be thinking, why are there two different... Um... Now, print works slightly different to echo uh, in the way that it is an it actually an older way to, and a more um, sort of traditional way, if you like, to print uh, data out, basically. Um, I mean, to the browser in this case. So it's also slower to use um, than echo. And if you want it to be really petty, it also has more characters. So people tend to find it's quicker to use echo. Also, when we're using print, uh, traditionally we would use um, brackets as it behaves more like a function, uh, even though it still is a language construct. So basically, uh, in short, it's a lot better to use echo. Um, the main reason for this is it being a lot quicker, using less system resources. So even though you can use print, um, and later on in the tutorial series we, we will come across things like print R, uh, which aren't in fact um, too tightly related to print itself, uh, but you will maybe come across print at some point in programs. However, if you're programming sort of from now on, uh, we're going to be using Echo and it's probably better to use Echo as well.